What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video and today I got my rear uh, strut bar in for the EP3. I already opened it, but um, let's go take a look at it. Uh, so I already kind of started a little bit. Um, hold on, let's see here. Alright. Alrighty, so as you can see right here, um, we have, uh, this is a top bar. This is very good material. For th I got this for 300 bucks um, from Russia. Um, it's pretty solid material, very heavy. Um, so hold on, let me get everything out. This is just the top piece. So let's put this down over here. And then, um, of course the back seat's on top of it, but it's pretty, pretty much just an X. Um, so, that bolts pretty much right into the strut um, and then it, it pretty much just bolts right in so we're gonna bolt it in only problem I'm having right now is hold on I'll, I'm gonna get in here some so what I'm gonna show what wow one issue I'm having is this freaking bolt right here it keeps stripping it's very tight um, uh, I think there's another bolt right here so I think if I get this one I can maybe swing it out and get the X in there um, I'm going to try that real quick, but here is the rest of the crossbar, pretty nice. I got red because I'm trying to do a whole black and red theme on the car, except for the wheels. I'm not, Actually, I'm going to talk about the wheels in a second, so be right back. We're going to try to get this bolt off. Well, after struggling with that screw, I finally got it out, and uh, I got to take the back seats out. So, take the back seats out. This will definitely most. This will most definitely be the last time I ever get a small car, being that I'm six foot and 230 pounds. So, I it's just it's just impossible to just do it. I can't. It's so it's so hard. But anyway, get the back seats up. And then we're gonna pop them out. All right. So. All right, so we got it out, a bit messy, but if you're uh, trying to get the back seats out of uh, uh, the EP3 SI, it just pops up, you try to just pull, and then right behind the middle seat, there's a one bolt, it's 10 mil, undo it, and it comes right out. So now, gotta get, this, uh, gotta get these seats out, and then we can finally put the strut bar on. So back seats are out, just a couple bolts, and it slides right out. So now I have to undo this bolt and see if it swings out. If not, then I gotta fuck with that thing. It's really annoying. Then do that side. All right, guys, what's up? It's day two of putting the crossbar in. I ran out of time yesterday because I had to go to work, but got a majority of it in. So. And there she is. Um, I still need to bolt those to the cross section, and then there's one bolt over there that I have to do. So, <clears throat> basically, what I had to do is there are these little tan sections right here. Basically, they're right back there, and there's a bolt. Hold on. There's a bolt right here. Um, hold on, let me. Get it in that bolt right there. Uh, just unbolt it and got to bolt it back in. This one's still loose a little bit, so I got to bolt that one totally in. That one's tight, and then I'm gonna have to loosen up the cross section real quick because I have to like pinch these together and then bolt it in. So just a couple things to finish up, and then I'm gonna vacuum up this place. And then I have a carpet uh, to put in. I don't know if I'm gonna put it in today, but um, it's a black carpet that comes all the way back that I'm gonna put in, so it's gonna look nice and clean. So let's uh, let's do this bolt, and yeah. All right, so all bolted in, put the bolts in there, and she is 
in there. So, last night it wasn't as sturdy, so I didn't really get the full effect. Um, really the full effect would be like no body roll, it's nothing like, it's not like incredible, but this car already handles insane, so putting a cross brace in it is just going to make it more handle even more. car already feels like it's on rails, so yeah, um, I'm probably going to clean the car now. Like I said, I want to put a carpet in here, I have it inside, um, I could do it now, but I don't know if I have the patience to do it. So, so that's going to be it for today's video. Um, so you saw the crossbar. It's really awesome. Um, keeps the back super stiff. Um, I can go around a corner at like 80 now, like with a finger on the steering wheel. Like, it's pretty crazy. Uh, I, li I like it a lot. Um, the next video I'm going to be posting, I'm going to try to post two videos every weekend. Um, so the next video is going to be the carpeting. I'm going to be putting carpeting in make it look really clean. It's going to be really nice. Um, then next weekend, I'm going to be doing the fuel rail and intake manifold. And I also have to get new intake piping. So I'm going to, I'm going to route it towards the bumper down and then got to get a breather, a breather intake for like uh, the CCV. Um, yeah, and that's pretty much it. So every weekend I'm going to try to be posting stuff because I work during the week. So yeah, make sure you like, subscribe, share, hit the notification bell. Like I said, you're going to be getting a video next tomorrow actually. So and next week. So yeah, peace guys.